Hello people, this is Baba Tony Ryan Gopala for Nubia Process Designer. I'm here today to discuss with you story tank modeling with plant 3D software. Here we are going to model up different types of story tanks we use in the process industry. We are going to work on a, a liquid benzene tank, a gaseous, um, we are going to work on gas story tanks, spherical tanks, pressurized tank. We are going to do atmospheric don't move tank you are going to do the model i've been working on the on the project for a while so i just want to show you guys how to do so you can actually start working on, on plant with it thank you we have a a layout diagram of the old plant so we are going to get started now to draw the tank model so to draw a tank model, you have to use create equipment command. So it's right there on the ribbon. So, yeah. so this is the form that you are going to use to create the any equipment that you want. If you use a tank or a vase, you can click on this place. So, yes. so you choose, well, because you are drawing tank, you can choose a tank model horizontal tank or vertical tank so this is a normal tank model like yeah. let's choose Vazo Vazo should be you, because the storage tank so choosing a Vazo should be there right? you choose the Vazo so these are the O shape here yeah. so cylinder toy spherical head so from here you can actually change the shape change and remove the shape and you want a flat button so we have a template I have a template that I've been working on so let's do the template so spare good tank so these are the tank the spare good tank is not the, this is not the picture so we have half sphere on the top another half sphere below then legs so you can specify the parameter for the for, for the tank here so we have the diameter this is the diameter of the sphere so they have the same sphere so you can generate the results from the same thing so here you are going to define your nozzle so we have only one nozzle here you can still add more, you can edit in other little but we are not doing that one today. So go back to equipment so, click on trade. So this is a shape. So you can zoom in to know the exact place where you want to place your drawing. So you are going to choose the exact position. You can actually put the coordinate in the command line or since this is just a modeling system, you just want to know how the plant looks like. So we are going to just play it. It is a layout, it's not done up to scale up to scale. So this just shows where to place the, the, the tank. The smaller circles are the spherical gas tank in the in the plant model. So, okay. so you get the exact position. And use the uh, you can move it later okay Let's put it at the bottom and point let's stop auto mode I think that's the reason I give me one It here. Yeah. The elevation is simple. So the next thing is to you know the assistant. So we are going to copy the exact same the you know, the same size. So we are going to copy this. And use the copy command. So we are going to copy it to the to the other circles. So copy command I need to specify base point okay. 
use auto mode to increase the tracking array. Okay. Something. Ah, now do something. So that's it. So the next tank. These are the gas tank. So we'll move on to a bigger tank which is liquid benzene tank. So there are two liquid benzene tanks in this system, this and this. So you have to use the create equipment command also. So you have to I have the template. If you want to create fact, you are going to you, are just, you just have to modify these two values, these two stuff here. If you want to have a body trim like such as leg, this where you go. Platform, skirt, shadows, a body flank that you want. So you add it to the template. This is the good tank. So I have another tank, vertical tank here. So this is a platform tank. So entry platform. So I have everything tank on the system. So cage flat head that will be bottom plate this is flat head <laughs> so we put I want to make my muzzle to fit the right direction so I think I'm using a blade snapping I can actually change it later Understand? You can change the nozzle, the ladder. Just so now it's facing the right direction. So we copy the selection again. Have some tanks to add the other hand, so we just have to edit the size later. What this is a little bit minimal so so 
this is a dome tank so i have to edit this back to a dome tank so you go to modify equipment you remove the plasma just go over here you don't know can so. can we do this size is the size not down for them so it's not that high. the size is not like it depends on tanks on to Yeah, okay. This is the army that to you. So these are uh, these are the water tanks. So it's water tank. So copy this tank to So now we have our tanks. We have our tank farm now. So from the system, these are the we have tanks tank systems tank farm so we have the product tank farm around there we actually store um pro basic products so these are for this place let me show you so this place is for pro dark low benzene products why these two places these two four tanks are for monoclo benzene products these are pro benzene tank so these are um, benzene these are produced for benzene too so so we just put those tank there copy those tank then we edit the dimension so switching you can just copy match properties when i'm done so we have So I copy for so I,
Uh, I have to move this one back to place. And just delete it. My system is a little bit slow, so I just have to be careful when I'm working. Try to just work with my experience. I think that's what you get with this thing. So thank you. That was so this is everything now. I'm done with the product. No, you can actually change the size of any product and that you want to buy everything you just here. So that's all the yeah, sure. I use zoom or command to zoom the. You, you can use the zoom or command to zoom or zoom extent. Just press Z on the command point. Z, then spacebar, then E. Everything will be zoomed. I think it does make it to be a shit. to your model and it's space. So next, I want to show you. I want to load an ex a the pipe pack that I make for the plant. So go to external web file. So you can actually see the thing. And, uh, so this is the pipe. So I load the one. I load the one. Three. Generate the pipe pack. So this is the pipe pack. Tank. This is tank. This is the processing you need to you still be doing most of the processing on that. So for now, we are stopping there. Thanks. I've been